Just some last thoughts and touch-ups before we leave this example. First of all, maybe you notice while I was drawing all of our branching, we, we either figure out if we're going to do an add or we're going to do a multiply, and both of them pop out at the same location right here. Did you notice, however, if I draw these lines all the way through, we skip this call. All right, we no longer do this call. We don't need to do this call because we are doing one step per iteration. We we write right above this code right here. We call calculate next power right here, and we don't want to do that twice. We don't need to do it twice anymore because one iteration of the loop performs one power. So that's that's kind of nice. We don't need this anymore, and it's not even being called anyway. The way I've set up my branching. We never, ever get there. So I kind of like how this is set up. Now, some other things I want you to notice. Is this jump essentially jumps straight to here. It jumps to the line of code right below it. So I could technically take that out. But the rabbit hole analogy I use, where I send one rabbit down this hole, one rabbit down that hole, and they both come out of the same location, let me tell you from experience, you want to be explicit, and you... That's fine to branch, branch, but then have them merge at the same location. And just me being slightly experienced, I hope a decade of experience would mean I'm slightly experienced, I am going to explicitly jump to here. Because that's what, if you use the high-level languages, if, else, well, an if and an else and continue and break and go to, uh, they're all go-tos. Okay, and the reason why go-to is bad is you can use go-to to say, oh, let's go this way and that way and jump over here and jump that way and da 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 All of a sudden, you're branching, you're branching, you really don't know what changed what and what state what's in, and oh, it's such a headache, and all of a sudden, it starts to look like a big bowl of spaghetti, hence the term spaghetti code, right? It's fine to branch, that's okay, branch branch, that's fine, but then meet up at the same location. And technically, yeah, I could take this jump out here and we would meet up at the same location, but I'm going to be explicit about it because the maintainability of this code, you go in here and change that code and all of a sudden leaving this out is actually going to cause you problems. So I'm going to be explicit there. We can also see a same kind of pattern right here. We could just say, hey, fall through to do multiply, but I'm being very explicit here and also the labels help me out as a programmer to understand what's going on here. So so there you go. Let me, let me just explain an if else real quick if you're familiar with this. Don't worry about it. But in higher level languages, which is pretty much any of them, we have this if else structure where we essentially say, hey, if some condition is true, like for example, if it's odd, or, or if it's even, one of the two, if, if it's even, then, or if it's odd, then do this code, else do this code. But in both cases, both will end up out here at the end of the if, if else, kind of off the, at the bottom of the screen here. They'll both branch out to the same location. And that's exactly what we've done here. And I want to be explicit about that. That's, believe me, I, coming from, pleading to you from experience, cleanly set up your jumps and your branches. When people say, oh, go-to's bad, and I've ranted on about that in previous videos where people will just say, oh, go-to's bad, but they really don't understand. I'm telling you why go-to is bad. It's because you can generate spaghetti code, and that's bad. But otherwise, we have branching structures for a reason. And if you use them cleanly and correctly and engineer your solutions as we have done uh, with this case then yeah use them correctly feel free you're a pro okay i've gone on about that i've beaten that dead horse down let's move on